Hello, Greg from Balloon Market here and welcome to BMTV. It's been a while since I've done a normal BMTV. I always say that when I've not done one for a few weeks, don't I? Yeah, I do. Well, we've had obviously Alberto. Um, we interviewed him up at Chesson the other day, so that was last week. And then we met Dr. Bob, that was good as well. So thank you to everybody that's, that's been involved. But uh, yes, it's me behind the table again. Right, if you're watching this on the day of release, it is, or it should be, the 22nd of June, 2017. Now, if it's your birthday today, do you wanna know who you're sharing your birthday with? I'll tell you. I got, I got on this website, right? And it's, it's I don't know, so I type celebrity birthdays into Google. Something comes up, I click on it, and then I scroll down. I'm scrolling down quite far to find somebody that I know. You've got 14 year old YouTubers that are considered celebrities. Anyway, I, I scroll down and then I saw somebody that I recognized. Yes, somebody old. Oh, no, no, you're not old. You're not, well, a little bit. Um, Meryl Streep. 67 today. Meryl, I know you watch the show. Thank you so much for watching. Really appreciate it. And um, yeah, 67 today. But you know who else has their birthday today? If you grew up in the 80s, you may remember the song, Girls Just Wanna Have Fun. Yes, Cindy Lauper. You can see why I did not get into the choir at school. Cindy Lauper, her birthday today. Cindy, I know you're a big fan of the show as well. Hello, thank you for watching. And uh, you, you will not believe how old Cindy Lauper is. She's actually 63. I couldn't Adam and Eve it. I was just shocked, absolutely shocked. But uh, yes, happy birthday to both of you. And if it's your birthday today, happy birthday to you as well. Right, summer is definitely here. I keep saying that as well. Summer is definitely here. It's getting hotter. I'm in my short sleeve shirt today. The, the jumper slash sweater slash pullover is gone. And um, yes, summer is, is here. So I thought I'd talk about some summery stuff. Now, what happens in summer? What do people eat? Ice cream. So I, I've got to tell you a story actually about ice cream. We were out as a family somewhere, I can't remember, last week, and I thought it was a treat. We got to our local ice cream parlor. Took the girls in there and Rach in there. Girls had, Sophie, eight years old, had waffles, sort of. It was the size of her head. It was a waffle with ice cream and stuff. It was amazing. I'm, I'm sure it was more than a week's worth of calorie allowance for her. But anyway, Rach had something, just one scoop of vanilla ice cream, but with an es espresso on it. I think it's called affogato or something like that. I, I hope I've not said anything rude in Italian, but I think it's something like that. And um, yeah, it's just ice cream with espresso. Oh, I've never liked coffee with cream or anything like that, but this was just absolutely beautiful. Really nice ice cream, vanilla ice cream, but yeah, recommend it. Anyway, ice cream, we've got these. These are ice cream cone decorations. They, you get three of them, as you can see, and they're 30.5, I don't know if they're 30.5 centimeters actually. It says 30.5 centimeters there, but it says 30.4 centimeters there. So they're about 30 centimeters, or 12 inches, as it's saying here, 12 inch decorations. So you've got three of them. You can see the three different, different heads of ice cream, if you like, and the three cones behind there. So they are in stock and available right now. Now, what else happens in the summer? Picnics, people have picnics. If you're watching this on the week of release, this is actually in the UK, National Picnic Week. Who'd have thought there was such a thing? Well, there is. So they want everybody to have picnics, whoever they are. Um, so I've brought some picnic boxes up, or party boxes. Now these are really useful. You can obviously put your picnic stuff in there and give it to kids and they carry it and sit down on the blanket and have all that. We actually used these a few years ago for our daughter's fifth birthday, I think it was, but it wasn't a picnic outside. It was, we were inside, but what you could do, you put all the food in each box for each child that's coming to the party and they eat what they can and what they don't, they put back in the box and they take it away with them because you give them a cake and they put it in the box. So it's, it works really well, less, less clearing up. So we've got those party boxes as well. Now, you've started to see, obviously in this month, actually there might've been some in May as well, but the, the, the pride marches for the LB, LGBTQ community. Um, and they're always very, very colorful, very rainbow-like. So I thought I would bring you some rainbows up, rainbow colors. We've got these paper garlands, pennant banners, we've got mini fan decorations and a fluffy decorations there. So all very colorful, brand new in to us. So um, yeah, really, really colorful. Now, the other week, a couple of weeks ago, was it? 
staff holidays and things happening. And so we knew the Monday was going to be seriously busy, and it was. So what we did, Rachel and I came in on the Sunday and we thought we'd get ahead, we'd do some picking and stuff like that. Came in as a family, the girls helped out where they could. It was, it was, it was an okay day. Went to McDonald's afterwards for, for dinner for the girls. It was all very nice. And just wanted to get ahead. And then I turned around and Rach was making this. Is that a good use of time? I don't know. Anyway, um, yeah, making a rainbow out of the Q Packs 260, 260 Q Pack. Um, now these are, Amscan obviously did their 100 pack version of these uh, a while ago and Qualitex are now doing these but just in the 50 bags. And I wasn't too sure, I talked to a few people that I, I, they weren't too sure if it was going to be that beneficial or not. But anyway, one of our customers came in, David, David, hello, thank you, came in, he's an entertainer and I don't think he was that bothered buy them but anyway he took some of the Q-Packs and he came in the following week he said they were great he said they saved me so much time because you've got your 50 balloons they're all facing the same way you've got your little perforation you tear that off and you put it in your bag in your your basket whatever it is you use to put all your balloons in and you could easily do a hundred bag bags of 50 so that would be 5,000 balloons you can easily do that in 20 minutes I reckon how long would it take you to do 50 bags of, um, of, of normal 260 cues? Pulling out all the colors and straightening them all and, and all the rest of it. It'd be quite, quite a long time. So we've been talking a lot about pricing at the moment, how a lot of people don't allow for their time or charge for their time. Well, if you are saving three hours of your time, you can either sell your service a little bit cheaper or you can sell it the same price and make more money or you can use those three hours to do some marketing on your business or you can use those three hours to go and have some family time whatever but you can save time and that's I think that's the key thing that's that's why people are that's why I think these Q packs are going to be really popular we've only got 20 of the colors in at the moment trying them out see how they go uh, I'd love people's opinions by the way if you have got any opinions please leave a comment down below on Facebook or on YouTube wherever you're watching and uh, yeah I'd love, love to love to hear your opinions if there's a particular colour that you want us to get in, please let us know and we will get that in. Now, talking of rainbows made of product, Rachel also did this one as well. Yes, this is our new glitter range from Oak Tree. Um, I, I got told off earlier on. Rachel came up and said, that's not in rainbow order. I don't know what's rainbow order. Red and yellow and pink and blue, is it? I don't know. But um, anyway, very nice, pretty rainbow type. It's kind of done a nice V-shape. Um, so glitter, yeah, glitter balloons. You can make glitter balloons with those. A lot of people uh, obviously use the, the glue stick, glue pens to write names on balloons if they've got decent writing and then put glitter on there. Good thing about this is that you can then, you just shake the glitter off and put it back into the tub and you don't wait, there's no wastage with that. So we've got that full range of, of glitter there. And speaking of glitter, obviously we've got these. I say obviously, it's not obvious. You didn't know they were there, but they are. So we've got these couple of banners from APAC, a just married one, a Mr. and Mrs. I apologize for not getting any of this stuff out and showing you. We're just a bit rushed today filming, so we've not really had time to set up very much, but we'll, we'll put pictures on here and you can see what they look like. Or you can visit balloonmarket.co.uk and have a look on their website and there'll be some pictures there. Um, so we've got these Glitter Very 2017. As you know, I've said that a number of times since February, since we went to the Spring Fair. And um, yeah, we've got the, the Just Married and the Mr. and Mrs. Garlands in there. Now it's summer, festivals happen. Lots of people going to festivals. Emily, who works downstairs, she was at the Isle of Wight Festival the other day. Very nice. And it didn't rain. Yes, it did not rain on the Isle of Wight. So that was good news. Um, so I, you know, I didn't bring enough. I came up very unprepared for this. But we've got the face paints. Lots of people do face paints and stuff like that at festivals. Uh, I did bring up some of the tattoos, the temporary tattoos. So we have those as well. Very festivally and summery and that sort of thing. And the last product I really want to talk about are these. Now, these are seven inch numbers and uh, we've obviously done the 16 inch numbers from North Star for quite a while and they're very nice they're very good they are quite big though when they're inflated if you wanted to use them for instance on a cake as a cake topper well there you go these seven inch ones are small enough I think to to put on a cake and you can do anything with them that you want to do um, but uh, they are you do need a heat sealer 
to use these. They are air fill only, but you need a heat sealer. We can provide these inflated, if you like, with a stick. However, they do cost more. They take up more space. Uh, you would have to pay for courier if you wanted those shipped out. And uh, we'd probably do that by, by invoice. But yes, we, we can get them inflated if you so desire. But at the moment, we've got them uninflated. We've got them in gold and we've got them in silver and they are available now. Uh, I've not really got much more to say other than it's summer, as I keep saying, it's summer. So what have you got planned for this summer? You're going on a big holiday somewhere. You're going holiday of a lifetime, three, four weeks traveling, I don't know, across America or something like that. Or are you focusing on your business? Are you going to take advantage of it being a bit quieter over the school holidays and get some marketing done? What are, you, what are your plans for the summer? Please leave a comment down below. Lovely to see you. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for subscribing. See you next time. Bye.